I'm going to be your student nurse today. Can you verify your name and date of birth for me? Um, Danielle Harrell, 414-94. Okay, so double check your wristband. Okay, and that is correct. Um, and then I would pull the curtains to provide privacy. Um, can you tell me where you are? Um, I am in the hospital. And do you know why you're here? Yes, um, abdominal pain. Okay, and can you tell me what year it is? Uh, 2016. Okay, so the patient is alert and oriented times four. And then I'm going to quick grab a set of vitals on you. Okay. Just to get a baseline. So I would do that first. And then I'm just going to start now with a head to toe assessment to just kind of overview everything that's going on, okay? Okay. So I'm going to start with the scalp. And there's no abnormalities. The hair is fine and evenly distributed. So that's good. And I'm going to take a peek in your ears, okay? There's no drainage noted. I do see some piercings, so you have your piercings, correct? Yes. Okay. I'm going to take a look in your nose now. And there's no drainage there. And in your mouth. Okay. That looks good. Or, um, the mucous membranes are moist and appropriate in color. And then, can you remove your glasses and just look straight ahead? I'm just going to shine this light, okay? Pupils are responsive and reactive to light, so that's good. And then just kind of follow my finger with your eyes without moving your head. Good. And now I'm going to start with some long sounds, okay? Okay. Good. And then I would continue to do the rest of the eight spots on the front, and I'm going to do a couple on the side. I would make sure to do all four on each side, and then I'm going to do a couple few on the back, okay? Okay. And then I would make sure to hit all ten spots on the back as well. Lung sounds are sounding good. And then now I'm going to listen to your heart, okay? Okay. I would listen to the apical pulse for a full minute. And I'd make sure to hit all five spots for the heart sounds. And those are sounding good. And now I'm just going to take a peek at your stomach. Okay. Warm my hands first. I do see a piercing, so I would note that. Do you have any discomfort with when I'm pushing anywhere in particular or just kind of all over? Um, just kind of all over. Okay. And there's no distension or abnormalities. I'm going to listen to your bowel sounds now, okay? Okay, okay bowel sounds are active and present. Um, when was your last bowel movement? Um, yesterday. Sorry. And have you been passing gas regularly? Yes. Okay. Good. And then I would, um, can you pull in my hands mm -hmm. and then push back? Mm -hmm. Okay, muscle tone and strength is good. Capillary refills are good. And then I would look for any swelling, edema, or bruising, anything abnormal on the eyes and on the arms. And if she had an IV site, I would check to make sure there's no swelling around that. So I'm going to take a peek at your legs, okay? Okay. And there's no edema that I'm noticing on them, and I would check to both legs to see if there's any swelling or, again, anything abnormal. And then first I'm going to have you push on the hands, okay? And then pull back, okay? Muscle tone is good. And then I'm going to check for fetal pulses. Okay, good. I'm going to take a capillary refill. And I would check for any abnormalities, and then I would also check the capillary refill on the other foot and um, check the pedal pulse to make sure that they're equal and good. All right, Danielle.
now. So I'm not seeing anything abnormal, which is good. So we're gonna go ahead and figure out what's going on with your stomach, okay? Okay, just let me know if you need anything. The call light's right here, okay? Okay. okay.